It's Holocaust Remembrance Day, and in Europe, remembering the Holocaust is not a very comfortable thing. How is anti-Semitism being played out in contemporary times? I could say that in Europe, almost no one uh, commemorate uh, Yom HaShoah, uh, the Holocaust Remembrance Day, today. Uh, it seems that everybody has completely forgotten to speak about what did happen to the Jews 70 years ago. And according to me, it's a shame and it's extremely dangerous. And the most part of the organizations uh, that are supposed to fight against anti-Semitism, fight against rightist anti-Semitism, but almost never speak about the anti-Semitism that kill people presently in Europe and especially in France, and uh, the anti-Semitism that kill people right now in Europe, especially in France, is Muslim anti-Semitism and uh, leftist anti-Semitism. And leftist anti-Semitism uh, is a big support of the Palestinian cause. And the Palestinian cause is a terrorist cause. It's a part of the radical Islamic cause. It has to be seen that way. If you don't see it that way, uh, you are completely blind. I remember when I gave lectures in Israel a few years ago, many people said to me, uh, what comes on Saturday will come on Sunday, uh, day, uh, a few years later. Mm -hmm. That's exactly what's happening in Europe. Europeans have been blinded by the leftist uh, to what was happening in Israel. In Israel, you had people using knives, but using cars, trucks to kill people. That's exactly what's happening in Europe right now. So if Europeans don't see that any kind of Islamic terrorism is anti-West and anti-Semitic, uh, people are blind and history can repeat again.